This product was made in the United States of America. The Johnson 7-inch Johnny Square is cast from aluminum using a very precise process. You'll notice that all of the numbers and markings are very clear and very easy to read, even at an angle. And you notice that there's a lot of numbers because they have a bunch of different scales on here. Plus, both sides of the square are identical, so you can use it whichever way you're going. Of course, the Johnny Square is very good for making super quick but very accurate square cutoff lines. But you can lay out just about any kind of angle cut just as accurately. And that includes laying out all the cuts to make rafters for a bunch of different roof designs. And because many of us don't have all this roof stuff committed to memory, Johnson includes this instruction manual. And you include a bunch of tables with all the numbers you need for figuring out a roof. This box with the ragged edges has a very useful purpose around the shop. This is for scribing very accurate lines parallel with an edge. And notice the special markers at 5.5 and, and 3.5 and inches that let you rip pieces that are equal to 2x4 or 2x6 materials. The notches are designed to hold a pencil so it doesn't wander while you're making the scribe line. The result is a near instant scribe line that's perfectly parallel to the edge. And in case you're wondering, yes you can use the Johnny Square for guiding a jigsaw or circular saw to make a nice square cut. And then there's this little feature in the middle of the square. And this one isn't for layouts or making any kind of a cut. More specifically, this feature is for later on when the work is done and all the power tools are put away. And it's time for a cold one. Now I realize that Johnson's 7 inch Johnny Square isn't breakthrough technology, but it is very well made and it's very useful in the shop. Equally as important is that this tool is made in America. So if you don't like tools that are made overseas, this is where you can step up and put your money where your mouth is and show the American manufacturers that they can sell tools made in America. Mm -hmm.